Hi once again. Um, this time I'm just showing you the little desk lamp that I use with my computer. Um, it's American. In fact, I picked it up over here at my favourite boot sale, Wimbledon, a few years ago. It needed a bit of work done on it. I think a couple of springs were missing. But apart from that, everything was okay. Now it's rather interesting because in England we don't have this type of arrangement. You can arrange to have the either lamp working. Now I'll switch it on. Here you've got the normal tungsten lamp, which is in fact an American lamp. The reason being, if I put a low energy lamp in, being heavier, this tends to balance this down. So it doesn't stay placed where it should should do. But that's on the tungsten lamp, 60 watt. Turn that off. On the outer, you've got the circline. This is a good, uh, a good lamp made in Japan with the Philips name on it. Oh, I think you can even use them. Both are light, I don't know. Yep. You can have it on both are light, so under whatever condition you're looking at the um, actual subject, you can use both. Now, being American, it's obviously 110 volts. There's the base of the lamp. Excuse all the other mess of stuff around. It's got some instructions or a little note and name at the back. I don't know if that's coming up. I always like to show everything I can. Um, it might be showing, it might not. I've left it on there a while. And also at the back you've got an outlet, an American outlet to run another lamp or a fan or something like that. The ballast for the tube is in this box. Um, now I'm feeding it off a transform which I might have shown on YouTube before. Excuse all the mess. This is a, a toroidal uh, transformer made in China, where else? Excuse all the bits and bobs. The other lamp I was using, which would be plugged in, I think that's the one I've got, I've got plugged in. Yes, look at that. It works. Another American lamp. It's just a short, it's on two levels as well, two levels of light. Yeah, just to show a little extra bits that I've got. Um, so many people are showing lamps and old lamps. This is not particularly old, but um, it's very useful and based on the angle poise ideal, ideal or idea I should say, it works superbly for what I want for the um, screen. Excuse the mess. I've also got my laptop working which was by, more by pure chance than, than luck. Also on there, the Americans might have noticed the old lamp which I have shown before and a pencil sharpener. Anyway, all for this time. I will try and sort out some other items to put up. As I say, I, unfortunately I don't speak German, I don't speak French. Uh, two of the members that I look at are, are French and German 
and they've got some interesting things but anyhow it's not a it's not a barrier you can get on um, anyhow thanks for watching that's the lamp itself if anyone knows of that picture at the back there I don't know whether I don't know whether it's genuine or not it's of a white pussycat in a grain store I think it's American the same picture appeared in a film and I can't even remember the name of the film but anyhow thanks again for watching excuse the antique dust there is some there and um, I will pop some other bits and bobs up mainly lamps at this stage there's not much there's not much doing in the greenhouse what I would say um, I might have found an answer for the lithops that were dying off I have simply flooded them and if there was anything in the soil that they were in there I think I've washed it out so it was the kill or cure method soaking them and f flooding them out so that if anything was in the soil it's not in there now so anyhow thanks for watching again and um, I'll put something else up soon thanks again